Welcome back guys. We got our first spark order of the day. We got the second spark order of the day. And this one was significantly better than the first one that I got. Do you feel safe? Most accidents involve cars yeah. or are caused by cars. Uh, I don't know. Things aren't looking too good as far as getting that bonus or at least one of them. Eh, we'll see what happens. All right, welcome back, guys. Today's the final day of our challenge which started on January 6th, which was Saturday. And it ends today, which is January 8th on a Monday. And as of yesterday, we managed to get five total orders out of 12 in order to get that $44 bonus or five out of 18, which would qualify us to get a $72 bonus. So essentially I have to try to get seven orders today. It can be curbside pickup, or it could be the shopping orders, which I prefer to do. And if I'm able to get those extra seven, get an extra 44 bucks. I mean, that'd be pretty sweet, but as far as whether or not I'm gonna pull it off, I don't know, that's a different story. It's not looking too good as far as that. But still, that being said, we happen to get our first order of the day. It's a shopping order at Walmart. So we're gonna run over there, gonna pick it up, do our thing, and I don't know, we'll see what happens. All right, guys, just got back home a few minutes ago and I'm actually back out with Lucy. She's in front of me, so you won't be able to see her. And it's pretty dark out here, but she's bugging me for a last minute walk <laughs> like she does every night. So of course I got to take her out. And yeah, I didn't quite get those bonuses. I only managed to muster out seven orders because I guess Spark didn't feel like sending me stuff today. Plus there weren't many orders going on going around anyway so whatever at least i gave it a shot right i mean on one hand it kind of feels like this whole challenge ended on a whimper but on the other hand i pushed myself i was determined and even though it didn't quite pay off that's okay because one i still worked and i still made money from this process and two makes for content that way you guys got something to watch from me and you know just bumping up those public watch hours, the engagement, and you know, just something that's actually good that you guys actually wanna watch. Cause you know, a polished turd is still a turd. So I don't want any of my content to be a bunch of turds. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I was thinking about having this whole trilogy, I guess, be one single video, but I decided to split it into three, to see which format's better. Cause you figure the trade off is that if you got one video, then the amount of watch hours is limited to one. And same thing with the viewership. And on the other hand, uh, it's potentially splitting that across three, potentially even more. And I think it turns out to be more. I'm not exactly sure, but whatever. Um, anytime that I do these work vlogs, 
I think that's what I'll do. Like, um, usually the weekend is the best time for me to do these work vlogs. So I'll probably just wind up doing that. All right, you ready to turn around, Lucy? All right, we'll turn around now. Um, these, these, um, these walks at night, they're not very long, but that's just for her to go do her last minute PP pee -pee and stuff. So that's cool. Um, anyway, yeah, so I'm thinking about moving forward, probably splitting into three days, three videos, anytime that I'm vlogging on the weekend, or I got a challenge that lasts, you know, that amount of time or whatever. So I don't know. Um, if you guys prefer that, just let me know in the comment section down below. And if you enjoy these videos, just do a lickety split to that like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to do so. I greatly appreciate it. And ring that taco bell. That way you get notified the next time I upload. And um, if you happen to see these feedback tabs, uh, just let me know. And you can fill them out real quick. I'd greatly appreciate it. Um, if you see with other content creators that you like, be sure to do the same as well. I hear it's supposed to help with the algorithm. Not exactly sure about that, but... I guess it's worth a shot anyway. And I'm supposed to say some other stuff. Oh yeah. <laughs> if you guys need to reach out to me in private about anything, you, know, you can reach out to me at Mike the Musical Vegan Beast, 69-426-66 at protonmail.com. And if you want to check out some of the interesting stuff that I got, you can take a look at my link tree. You'll find my affiliate link with Stash. And if you know, you'll find my tip jar with Cash App. And uh, if you want to support me on Patreon, buy me some coffee. And there's resources to help you and your family and friends go vegan. And I don't know, you might find something else interesting over there. And of course, quick shout out to my regular subscribers and viewers. Everybody that licks my videos, they like, they share, they comment. They do all that good stuff so I can keep making those vegan and algorithm gains. I love you guys. And I appreciate you guys. And I'll see you next time. Take care.